More to come, lawmakers in the Nigerian House of Representatives yesterday rejected calls seeking a curb to the proliferation of higher institutions, particularly universities in the country. Arguments on whether or not university establishment bills should still be considered by the House also came under debate when a bill to establish the University of Transportation in Dara was presented for concurrence on the floor of the House. Emmanuel Hijene completes the report as presented from our studios. The establishment of new universities while existing ones continue to suffer neglect through underfunding has continued to receive knocks by the Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASSO, over the years. Despite this, both chambers of the National Assembly continue to regularly churn out a plethora of bills establishing different higher institutions of learning. We can amend the enabling law, the enabling act, and then um, upgrade the, one, the NITT to a federal university. Because why I'm saying this, Mr. Speaker, is the constant proliferation of universities in our country is not helping us. That is the truth. We have so many universities here and here. We have so many university bills. And at the end, when it is, um, when it is approved, we will now be talking about funding, no funding. And we know the current situation we are facing right now in the academic sector. Another proposal that continues to generate argument is the move to establish the University of Transportation in Katsina. If we are true to true to working on our policies, we have a UN convention as to what was uh, what was supposed to be being UNESCO uh, uh, a, a percentage to education and various treaties. If we are doing that and following that strictly, I want to say that we will have more investors and there will be more room for funding and we'll have the best of education in our country. Thank you, sir. Anything worth doing is worth doing well. This universities are citadels of knowledge. I you don't just set up, even all over the world, you, you have mushroom universities, and we don't want that. We don't want that. Uh, you know, like they say, garbage in, garbage out. So we have to strike that balance, perhaps with the amendment to the Nigerian Universities Commission bill. The same way we try to stop proliferation of banks and make it more difficult to establish banks, but not impossible. I think it's the same way we should go invest in until such a time when government is no longer funding universities. The lawmakers, however, okay the bill for concurrence due to political reasons, but agreed that the calls to stop the proliferation of universities are genuine insisting that the National Universities Commission Amendments Bill will help in addressing the issues. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.